All right, hello everyone. Today we are going to be using a hoe dozer and a uh, drill guide to install a door lock. So here's the drill guide, very easy to use. All you're going to do is attach it to the door, screw down the uh, thumb tightener to get it nice and snug. As you can see there, we're going to be cutting uh, into both holes, the front and the side. I already have my drill set up, so this is what it looks like. This is after I made the cut. That's why it's all dusty. It has wood over it. So you just place it on the door like so, tighten it down with the uh, thumb device, the screw device. And as you see on the floor, I already cut it. That's wood inside of the uh, hole dozer with the drill bit. Now this is a wood spade. This was closer, but they also have a, a dedicated dozer. You'll see in the minute. It's just a smaller version of the larger one. And uh, as you can see, I've already used the larger one to cut the uh, doorknob hole because I couldn't hold the camera and film at the uh, cut at the same time. So I'm going to use the wood spade on this hole where the locking uh, cylinder, the locking mechanism goes. And the reason I did this was because the original hole when I purchased the door was just too low for some reason. So you're going to see it's usually much quicker than that, but I'm trying to hold the camera and drill at the same time. And if I push too hard, the door is just going to swing. So here's what it looks like front and back. This is the main dozer for the door lock. And it even comes in a kit with everything you'll need and easy to follow instructions. So as I said before, the reason I actually uh, made a new hole because the pre-existing hole, uh, when I purchased the door, it was just too low. Now I'm about 6'2", and it was like I had to reach down uh, when I was installing the lock. It just didn't feel right, and I measured it, and the measurement was off. So I decided to patch the existing hole, as you saw, and bring the lock up about four or five inches, drill the hole, put the lock on, and everyone's happy. So you can find this at Lowe's and Home Depot. So yeah, get to it. Thanks for tuning in, and I will see you next time.